and how I rid myself of scabies. How I almost got eaten alive by scabies. One day, I decided to go on vacation, so I traveled around the country a little. I booked my stay online and stayed at an apartment. It was okay, a little small, but I was on having a ball, so the apartment size didn't matter too much. The tenant of the apartment had a small dog, but the pooch was gone way before I booked, at least so I was told. When I was there, I had a little itching on my arm. I thought it was a mosquito and it went away after a few days. No biggie. When I got home about a little over a month later, I really started itch in the same location on my arm, and the itching got worse at night. The next day, I went to visit the local walk-in clinic. They examined me. They saw nothing. Maybe they thought I was crazy. Was I? I was given a bill and was told to go see a local dermatologist. So I called one up the next day and booked an appointment. When I got there, they gave me a medical doctor instead. The receptionist lied. There were no dermatologists there, and I had already paid my appointment fee. Anyway, since I was there, I saw the medical doctor. He was a nice guy, but he saw nothing wrong with me. He only prescribed steroids and some kind of allergy medication. The itching went away for seven days and then came back with a vengeance. I returned to the doctor and he put me on the same medication but a stronger dosage. He also gave me a blood test and checked for everything under the sun. That was expensive. He said my results would be back in two weeks. In the meantime, the itching went away again while taking the seven-day medicine. Then it came back with a vengeance again. What the hell was eating me alive? I finally saw it was leaving scabs all over my arms and now it was spreading. It spread to my back, my chest, my legs, and my scalp. I was under serious attack. I wanted to die. The severe itch was unbearable. My test results came back and it was blank. Nothing. I continued enduring this for about six months now. I finally called my mom and told her about my predicament. She was a nurse and heard about such a case. She told me to run to the pharmacy and get sulfur 8. I was desperate and willing to try anything. I took the sulfur 8 head scalp conditioner and rubbed it all over my body. Nothing happened, but it was soothing. I went to sleep, and voila, no more itch. I went immediately on Amazon and ordered me two sulfur soaps. The war was on now. After some search, I found a group. All was suffering from the same thing. It was scabies. Gross. Got it from the dirty apartment sheets or something. I also washed all my clothes and linen in hot water and anything I touched. And I washed my body in sulfur soap for two extra weeks just to make sure. Now I'm happy and bug-free.